Okay, so the only center of a triangle that we haven't created together in these little videos is the in center. Let's go ahead and do that, the in center and the in circle. And then I'm going to have you as an assignment create a sketch that has all of those. But first of all, let's create an in center and an in circle together. So we need a triangle. We need to bisect angles. Under the line tool, there's the angle bisector. So you just click on three in a row with the vertex of the angle being the, the one in the middle. So B, A, C will bisect A. If I do B, C, A, or A, C, B, it will bisect at C. And then A, B, C, or C, B, A to bisect there. And there's the end center. So let's see, we want to find the intersection of two of those which will be the intersection of all three. There's the end center. If I wanted to find the end circle, let's hide these lines. Okay, so the end circle would go from this point perpendicular to the sides. So I'm going to construct a perpendicular line from our in center to one of the sides and then find the intersection so there's a point on the circle and that's all I need now to construct the circle we'll go from there to there there's the in circle let's hide this let's hide that extra point let's hide that label I don't like that label and there we go we can drag it around and see that we always have the circle inscribed in the triangle. Yeah. So I've shown you various things you can do with GeoGebra. Basically the way I learned it I'd already used Geometer Sketchpad quite a bit and I thought that it was really intuitive. You just click around on the pictures, click around on the menus and you can figure most things out. There's a help menu, you can look up on the web how to do different things. So your first assignment, and I'll put this in Vista also, I would like you to create a sketch that has a triangle with all four of the centers. Okay? The in center, the circumcenter, the ortho center, and the centroid. So you've already done that in GSP, so you, you should know the basics of that, and you've seen me construct them all. So I'd like you to construct in GeoGebra to turn in a sketch that has a single triangle with all of those centers, hide everything except the centers. So any construction lines you use, hide those. You want to just show the triangle and the centers. And then how about the Euler line? We've talked about the Euler line, so construct the Euler line which goes through everything except the end center. It'll go through three of those. Okay? So that'll be your first assignment and we'll have another video to look at some of the more algebraic capabilities of GeoGebra and then of course once I get back the next couple of weeks we're gonna use GeoGebra to do several other things.